Hello, my name is Rachel. I love clothes and getting things in the mail. So guys, I have another Temu haul for you. This one is not sponsored. I purchased all of this myself. They once again got me with a, a late delivery. It showed up like a day after. They refunded me like because if if the if your delivery shows up past the date they promised, they give you a $5 credit. And it showed up the day after. They gave me a $5 credit, but then I had this $5 credit. So then I went and bought a few things that had been in my wish list for a while. But before I get into what I actually purchased, I want to show you something I actually won. <laughs> I've been playing, they, they have these two games, Farmland and Fishland. And I've been playing both of them. And I won this on Fishland. It was a side quest on Fishland. I haven't actually won the main game yet. I think it might actually be impossible if you're not get actively getting people to sign up, and I am not. I am only sharing. <laughs> you know, with with I have friends that we share back and forth, so we can get the sharing bonus, and then uh, and then of course um, you know there's other ways for you to earn like orders. Like when I made this order, I got some extra points, but you would have to make a lot of orders to get the points you need to win the games. And I def that definitely wouldn't be worth it unless you were just making those orders anyway. I was just going to make this order anyway. But I did win a side quest. On f the whole point of that rant is I did win a side quest on Fishland. I won this adorable little crystal skull doorknob. And it comes with a little screw. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to put him on yet. I'm going to save him until I move and find something nice to, to put him on. I did get this uh, coffin like um, a bathroom cabinet mirror thing for the 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 bathroom that we were putting into the garage uh and and it, i think there's a handle on that i might be able to replace it with this handle that would be really cool i'll have to look into that i can't remember exactly what it looked like i ordered that on amazon i didn't show it to you guys because i had it shipped directly to brian's house and then it got installed but when i eventually when all that work is eventually done and i get to show you my new space workspace with that bathroom you'll get to see that but yeah, so I just wanted to start with the little crystal skull doorknob that I won. And I think these are like $2 each if you just wanted to buy them. And I will try to put associate links down in the description box below for everything, including this, if I can find it. And let's move on. All right, so this is these are the things that I ordered. <laughs> I ordered a couple of large things. I ordered a pair of shoes. I don't, I've ordered a few pair of shoes from Temu, and I've actually been happy with every pair I've ordered. Uh, they, they've all been, you know, I don't wear them every day, so I can't really attest to, you know, how well they hold up to wear. I, I wear them because I, I just have a lot of shoes, and I have my most comfortable shoes that I wear all the time. So I only wear them, like, you know, once a month maybe sometimes, once every other month. But I've been wanting a pair of faux fur-lined shoes because it's cold. <laughs> and I found these cute little boots, and they just have, like, this muted colored pattern on the front, but they are completely faux fur lined and the faux fur is super soft. These boots feel really light. They are, I'm sure, just faux leather and a foam sole. And I, again, won't know until I start wearing them. <laughs> now I did get these in a size 40. I am normally, when they do the European sizes, uh, sizes of 38 or 39, but I did go off their size chart. They said that this was the size U U.S. size 8, I believe. So I did go with the 40. Uh, hopefully the, they will fit. We will try these on, of course, at the end of the video. But, yeah, I just thought they were so cute. They've got those two little straps. And, yeah, they're just really cute. <laughs> and, and I'm hoping they'll be warm, warm and toasty. All right. Moving on. The next large item was this dress. I did I did get another piece of clothing. Because, you know, I desperately need more dresses. <laughs> but in the down in the description, they said this was by Dressfo, which is uh, either Dress Lily or, or whatever that other one that's just like Dress Lily is that I can't remember the name of right now. Yep, and this is by Dressfo. It is a extra large from Dressfo, and so yeah, that's so that's the uh, like I said that that's the uh, Rose Gal and that other brand that's similar to Rose Gal. They they have Dressfo as their as their brand, but it's just this really cute little plain black dress. It has uh, thumb holes down on the sleeves, and it's just simple, just simple. It has a little string. 
that ties around the waist. And yeah, we'll be trying that on here in a second as well. And has this little like this part just sort of folds over at the neck. And I just thought it was cute and simple. And it was only like, I want to say like $15 as usual. Uh, I'll be having the prices up here somewhere. But yeah, I will be trying that for one for you also at the end of the video. <laughs> And then I did get a pair of fishnets to go with this. I built a whole little outfit. <laughs> but what makes these fishnets unique is the other leg, the stripes go the other direction. So one leg you have vertical stripes and then the opposite leg you have horizontal stripes. So I, I'm going to try those on as well. <laughs> but I think I will only have the one try on because I'll be able to fit everything into one outfit. See. Only a few more items in here. I, I honestly don't remember what this total was. I want to say maybe $30. And then, of course, I had the $5 uh, you know, credit. So I got more of these. These are really cute. They're just little plastic charms with our favorite spooky ladies on them, like Lydia and Wednesday and Morticia. And I've been making earrings out of them. And I could probably also use some on necklaces. But... There's like enough to, to make one set of earrings of each character. Like here we have the Lydia. But yeah, and there's Elvira and Vampira and Wednesday. So really cute charms. And uh, the earrings have been somewhat popular. I just recently vended and did sell several pair of the earrings I made from these. And then this. These are just socks. <laughs> just a, a six pack of crew socks, like little little ankle socks, which I do like to wear these types of socks, uh, but they have bats on, on both sides. And it's just, they're just black socks. It's just six pair of black socks, all of them with these cute little bats. They I did also see, uh, I don't think it was on the same listing, but the exact same thing, but in colored socks. So if you didn't want all black socks, if you're doing more pastel goth, they did have these in a kind of, they were kind of pastel-y colors too. <laughs> with the little bats on. I just thought the bats were so cute. And I, not too long ago, went through my sock drawer and threw out a whole bunch of old tattered socks and stuff. So, so this is a nice little replenishment of all of that. And then the final thing in this Temu haul, and then we can go try that outfit on. I did get a piece of jewelry, an actual piece of jewelry that I'm not going to be turning into other jewelry. It's a ring, but it's so cute. <laughs> It's a little butterfly with a pentagram in the center. You can see him there, and it's just like a, you know, die cut metal cutout design. So very simple, but really cute. I really like him. So that is it. That is the the final thing I did get in this Temu haul, and I'm going to uh, we're gonna go try that on in a minute. Before I do that, just down in the description box, if you if you are already on Temu and you play Fishland or farmland. I'm going to have my links down below because if, if you click on the link and then accept my invitation, we get, we both get a bonus on that. <laughs> and then, um, I'm also going to uh, have a link if you want to join their affiliate program, because I'm also a Temu affiliate. So if you use any of the links I have down in the description box, I uh, have a possibility of earning money or earning seeding balance, which gets me free stuff. Like, uh, last week I had a, a sponsored haul that was stuff they they gave me a thirty dollar seating balance and and then that stuff was free from them <laughs> so so if you use my links I can possibly earn something in one of those ways just so you know and they, uh, but there's also going to be a link for you to join the associate program if that's something you're interested in as well as associate links for hopefully everything I showed you here in this video so that's it let's go try this on I'll be right back hey guys I am back. The dress, it is, uh, again, extra large. I didn't tell you my measurements. My measurements are 40, 33, 43. I am a U.S. size 12, usually an extra large. Sometimes I can get away with larges. Sometimes I can get away with larger. <laughs> but I want to talk about the fabric. This is a really nice soft fabric. It feels like a brushed sheet, uh, if, you, if you know what I'm talking about, where it has almost that suede feel to the touch but it doesn't really have like a pile to it or anything so it feels like a brush sheet so it's not that weird swimsuit material that a lot of these types of things are made from even and I finally remembered it's 
Dress Lily, and Rose Gal. <laughs> and they even, even they occasionally do use that swimsuit like material for stuff, but this one is not that. It's super soft. It is, however, a bit clingy, which is, I guess isn't too bad, but you know, could possibly show off all the lumps and bumps. <laughs> But also a bit staticky, but that's because it's dry in the house. The heat's on. <laughs> but the dress is super cute. I do like the dress. The uh, tights are really cute, too. I love a, like, mixed pattern tight where it's uneven on the different legs or has multiple different patterns throughout the fishnet. So I really do like these fishnets. And so I'm not going to smack it over. <laughs> and then the shoes. The shoes are incredibly comfortable. They're just, you know, just cute little flat boots. And I feel like they would be really warm. And they were about, I want to say about $20 for the shoes. The dress was maybe somewhere around $15. Of course, there will be prices up here somewhere. The fishnets are around $2, something like that. But there will be prices somewhere on the screen for you to, to know exactly. But, yeah, the shoes are, I really do like the shoes. I am happy with the shoes. They're cute. They're comfortable. I think the 40 Maybe the right size. Maybe I could have gone down one size. And, and like 38, 39 is my normal. But it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell without actually having the other one to try on. Because I feel like there's a little bit of room in them. But at the same time, I feel like they fit well. So I'm not real sure. <laughs> I'm not real sure if I could have gone down a size in these shoes. If that would have made them too tight on my toes. But they are super cute. And I can't wait to actually wear them outside to see how they hold up. <laughs> And I guess that's it. That's everything I have to share with you guys today. Let me know what you thought about this Temu haul down in the, uh, what's that called, <laughs> comment section below. And if you did enjoy this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy the video, of course, you can give me a thumbs down. And please tell me all about it in the comments below. And please subscribe to the channel. And I hope everyone is just staying happy, healthy, and safe in this incredibly crazy world we're living in. And I will talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.